Okay, today uh, I have an ESSA Abloy SCD lock. It has very good tolerances. This is the bidding on the key. The lock does work. It is locked up. It is a six pin. And um, the keyway is uh, fairly wide open. So there's no problem most of the time with the picks. Let's see if we can uh, put a leather around this. Nothing is binding on it, so on this um, SCD lock, you need to uh, really concentrate on it and don't over set the pins. Some of the pins you may set and not realize they're set, and it will um, open up on you uh, after you've uh, set three or four pins and. You think, well, I missed some pins, but actually you did not miss any pins. They're just very hard pins to fill, set. They just do not uh, work like uh, any other lock. Let's use the top of the keyway, and let's try this pick. Let's go to the back of the lock. And just fill each and every pin as you go to the front. Okay, there's pin one, pin five, a little bit more on pin five. Okay, more on pin one, pin six, okay there's some more on pin six, got just a little bit of a false set, or a turn on the plug, maybe don't want to call it a false set, but uh, Okay, there was a pin four. Okay, this is where you get to the point to where you don't really know whether you've got all the pins set or not. So let's change picks. And there it is, open on pin three. These um, S Abloy SCD locks are uh, do have a good tolerance. If you can um, open one of these locks, uh, you should be able to open any lock. So let's uh, strip it down and take a look at the pins. But a lot of the pins you uh, may set and may not even feel it or feel that you have set the pin. It is uh, very hard to uh, distinguish uh, between setting and oversetting. Okay. See what we can do with this lock now. 
See if we can get it out without messing up this gutting. We sure don't want to mess the gutting up on it. Alright, what's wrong with you? Okay, there it is. Okay, it has all six pins in it. And uh, for some reason this is a very tight keyway. But all the bottom pins in this lock are standard. And there has not been any modifications made to the uh, lock at all. It's from the factory. So it has all the same kind of pins. It's an ASA pin. I didn't put this one, let me turn this one around, but they're both the same on each end, so it doesn't really matter about uh, how they're put in this lock. Let's see if we can get that pin out. Okay, there's pin four. I know it's pin five, I've got... Uh, one too many there. Put it in the wrong spot. Okay, pin six. All right, this uh, lock doesn't have any uh, changes made to it. It does have a place for a sidebar, but this lock does not have a sidebar. The uh, plug itself is not set up for a sidebar. Okay, let's take a close look at the pins. Sorry about that, not having that camera down on the pins. Okay, everything in the bottom is standard. These are all steel pins, I believe. These are just the uh, acetite pins on um, all six of them. Okay, that's what we have in this uh, ASA, ASA Abloy SCD lock. Uh, appreciate your time. Please do not do anything illegal. And please stay out of trouble. And thank you again for watching.